Hello and welcome to StatLab StatCrunch videos. Today I'm going to be talking about how to find the area of the shaded region under the standard normal curve. Well, you can go ahead and use your standard normal table, but make sure you read what the table gives you. If you're using the StatCrunch, uh, the StatLab table, it would give you the area to the left hand side. So please be very careful if you're using your table. But today we're going to go ahead and look on how to find the area using StatCrunch. So I'm going to go ahead and click on StatCrunch. And I'm going to go to Stats, Calculators. It is a normal curve, standard normal curve. So I'm going to click on this one. And if you move your mouse over, it's going to tell you exactly what it is. See, it says probability. So this area would give you probability. And if I go over here, it says your reference value or the Z value. Okay. So now the problem is asking us to find the area to the right hand side of the Z, which is 0.85. So I want the area to the right. The cool thing about here is I'm just going to plug Z as point. 85 and I'm going to click compute. You see the graphs don't match here. I get the area to the left, but here I want the area to the right. So what you're going to do is you're going to simply go ahead and change your icon to less than to greater than and voila, your areas match. So the area or the probability under the curve, which is 0.1976. And depending on how they ask you to round off, you're going to go ahead and do that. So let me go ahead and take a look at um, this said round off to four decimal places. So four decimal places, it is point, let me see, 0.1976. Okay, so let me go ahead and do that. 0 0.1977, enter. Fantastic, good job. Moving on to the next one. So here they want us to find the area between these two Z values. So I'm simply going to go ahead to my stats. Where is it? To my stat. Um, crunch table here and I'm gonna click on the between button and then I know it has to be between 0 and 1.1 and my area is 0 0.3643 4 decimal 0 0.3643 and check my answer and that's good and now again I'm gonna go ahead and open my stat crunch here and what did they ask me? They asked me to find to the left. So I'm going to go back to standard. This is the greater than is to the right hand side, the less than is to the left hand side. So negative 0 0.23 and compute. And my area is 0 0.4090. Four decimal places. So 0 0.4090. Bingo. Okay, and hope that helps.